everybody, Lisa Guerrero here with Inside Edition and I'm in a car on my way to, believe it or not, three different stories today. I am shooting the end of what has been our preparation time for November sweeps. Our November sweeps period starts next week. So I'm shooting three different elements for three different stories that we have in progress, along with, I think we've got in total between eight and 10 investigations for November sweeps, which is a ton of great stories. I can't wait to show you them, but come along with me for the ride today. It's gonna to be a crazy day. I started this morning at six o'clock where I woke up for hair and makeup and wardrobe for my first shoot, which I'm on the way to right now in New Jersey. So still on my way to the location, which was about an hour away from my hotel this morning. It's beautiful here in New Jersey. And um, part of my job, of course, be between preparing for all of these shoots, getting hair and makeup ready, um, doing my research, talking to my producers, etc., is also taking COVID tests twice a week. Uh, of course, I've been vaccinated and you should get vaccinated too if you're not um, already. But yes, I've, uh, I've just got my results back from my latest COVID test and I'm negative, of course, so that's good. Um, just wanted to let you know what some of the things are that I have to do every day and throughout the week to prepare for the Inside Edition investigation. So I'm on my way, um, of course, uh, COVID negative, and um, we'll be looking forward to shooting three different stories today. So this is the first of our three shoots today for three different investigations for Inside Edition. We're in a suburban, beautiful neighborhood in New Jersey doing a story about how ring cameras are helping law enforcement. They're kind of like the high-tech version of Neighborhood Watch. And guess who's with me? There's my photographer. That's Phil. He's lighting me right now. The person that's shooting me, turn around, is Katie. That's Katie. <laughs> Katie Taylor is one of our producers. And then we've got our story coordinator, Megan Lupo, who's helping us out today. So we are almost done with shoot number one. Meal break. Okay, so we just finished our second of three shoots today. We went from Ridgewood, New Jersey to Brooklyn. I'm now in a gym because we're doing a story about the dry scoop challenge. If you haven't heard of this, you're gonna want to, as you can see, outfit number two. I'm about to change into outfit number three and we're gonna head to our next location for our third Inside Edition investigative shoot of the day. Okay, our third shoot of the day is a very serious shoot, actually. We're doing an investigation about spiked drinks at bars and how that is now on the rise because of the pandemic winding down. So more and more people are going out to bars. They stand next to each other as they're, they're greeting and waiting for people at the, at the bar. Of course, they're ordering drinks. And so we're doing a story about how easy it is to somebody to slip a drug into your drink that is odorless, colorless, you can't even smell it, you can't taste it, nothing. So these kinds of crimes are on the rise and this is our third shoot of the day today in New York. So here we've got Bill setting up the shot. We've got Katie who is producing this element of the story and this investigation. We've got our expert, Steve Cardian. He's gonna give us some safety tips. And what's your name? My name is Maddie. Maddie's helping us out today. So Maddie is going to help us demonstrate how easy it is to slip, drink, to slip drugs into people's drinks. And this is Steve Cardian. He's gonna help us out. Hey Steve. And here is the drink, soon to be drugged drink and he's gonna show us how this happens. And that's Phil looking at me. Seriously, stop <coughs> shooting Lisa. Stop shooting Lisa so we can shoot the real thing, right? That's a wrap. Believe it or not, three stories in one day for Inside Edition. That means we are well on our way to November sweeps. That also means that I am well on my way home back to Los Angeles. This was a 12 hour day. Thank you Greenwood Park. Thank you to my awesome crew. 
with Phil and Katie and Megan and everybody who helped us today. I can't wait to get home. I'm tired. I need a bath. I need a glass of wine.